Hello, this is the review of the Pile PLR DD19UB. Seeing as there is no review on the YouTube or on Amazon, this is a review of it. I've already opened the box. As you can see, this is the exterior. I bought it for my Honda. So the stock old one was broken, so this is the review. What comes in the box includes the stereo itself. It comes with the connections, a fuse, RCA cables, and antenna input. Very light, very small, depth wise. Uh, the buttons feel nice, very tactile feel, big screen, one knob, auxiliary, includes a USB, aux, and a uh, micro SD card, Bluetooth, later I'll show you in the car, it also comes in with The sleeve that was attached to it, it said to remove it in the little manual. Remote control with the battery input already attached. You just remove this plastic thing for the battery to turn on. The remote control is infrared. The infrared is located right here. Comes with the pre cut and labeled wires and connector. These would go in the back of the stereo. Connect like that. And you attach this either to the wiring harness or directly to the car where you cut the, the cables from the old connector. Each one is labeled clearly and color coded. The manual includes all the wires and how to connect them, it includes a warranty explainer, where to log in, who to contact. And they write a review to get better service or a warranty extension. It also includes the actual manual, which tells you what the wires have, where they're located, how wide and big the radio is, which is 183 millimeters by 110 millimeters tall, and the installation. It also comes with the back brace bracket. Since it is very thin. And all the connectors and screws. Later on I'll show you inside the car. Once I've connected everything. This has been the overview of the pile. 19 UB with Bluetooth. All right, see you inside the car. Okay, here's the radio in the car. Um, to turn it on, it's just holding the center button, it'll turn on. All the lights turn on. Here's the radio, you can change modes. There's 3 FM, 2 AM. La oferta vence el 31 de diciembre de 2015. The car. The auxiliary is uh, here. Uh, USB, auxiliary, and micro SD card. The brightness on the dot on the lights can be dimmed down or dimmed up. Um, six standard. 
has Bluetooth. The Bluetooth works great. Uh, you can pause, skip, uh, and play with uh, the radio headset. It's an easy connection, really quick, and it works uh, great. Uh, I, I thought I was going to need wires, but uh, the Bluetooth is sufficient. Um, here's the volume. You can see the equalizers. That's not annoying at all. You can even dim it down, but they're always there. The only thing is when you're connected to Bluetooth, it always says uh, the phone, and you can't change it. It doesn't, cha it doesn't change to time or it doesn't change to anything once it's on Bluetooth. The speaker, the mic, uh, from the other side is very low, like a medium volume, and it's hard to understand the people. But I'm not going to be using the phone, I'm just going to be using the Bluetooth. Um, otherwise, I completely and utterly approve of this product. This is a great choice for anybody that wants a doubled in radio at a very reasonable price with all the modern fittings. And I'll catch you on the next one. Thank you.